Welcome to the ERP implementation tips and tricks series, where we will piece together practical strategies, insightful guidance, and actionable tips to solve the puzzle of a seamless ERP implementation journey. Our trick today, engage key stakeholders from different departments in the process of implementing ERP. Let's look at how we can apply it. Firstly, we will start with stakeholders identification, identify individuals or teams from different departments who will be affected by the ERP implementation, such as finance, procurement, sales, production, IT, human resource, and so on. Then establish a cross-functional team. The cross-functional team responsible for overseeing the ERP implementation process could be called process owners, key users, power users, and so on. Actively involve stakeholders in training sessions and change management activities, such as workshop seminars and interactive sessions, to ensure they are well prepared and equipped for the ERP system transition. The purpose of involving key stakeholders is a comprehensive task. It drives system adaption and acceptance. By actively engaging stakeholders, organizations ensure that the ERP system is embraced and utilized across departments, maximizing its benefits. So involving key stakeholders boosters alignment and collaboration across departments. Collaboration breaks down silos and promotes a unified approach towards achieving organizational goals, enhancing efficiency and productivity. In that sense, involving stakeholders ensures cohesive and comprehensive requirements. The conclusion of today's trick is engaging key stakeholders from different departments is a vital for a successful ERP implementation. Their involvement brings expertise, comprehensive requirements, collaboration, and improved system adaption. This approach fosters effective communication, departmental alignment, and positive business outcome. That's it. Thank you.